Well, we knew that this weekend was going to be a real challenge because our, our competition so far this season has not been real strong. It's been a relatively soft schedule overall. It wasn't planned necessarily to be real soft, but there have been some teams that were a little bit down this season and uh, we went over them a little bit easier than we expected. But then there's also been a Baylor who's gone on and done well. Ball State who's done very well. And, and we knew tonight playing the two best teams out of Big East this weekend um, would be a real challenge. And if we could steal a couple of wins, it would really help our RPI, it would help our NCAA tournament uh, resume and all those kinds of things. And so we were looking forward to the weekend, but not really knowing for sure what would happen. Uh, we got the tough news just on the way over on Thursday night that uh, Carly Kramer was not going to be able to play. She's got an upper leg issue that is kind of a week-to-week -week type thing. And um, as you know, she's somewhat of an emotional leader on our team and a real floor general. And I don't think we adjusted real well on Friday night against Louisville to not having her on the floor. Uh, I didn't, just didn't think that we had a real um, a solid team effort that night. Louisville had a lot to do with that. They played very, very well. They didn't back down from us. And, and that was a great win, the fact that we came back and won it in five after losing game four, uh, not, not playing very well. So to turn it around and win game five, it, it, it ended up being a quality win despite a mediocre performance. And then I, tonight, I was really proud because I, I really thought it was going to be a character game. Uh, as to whether or not we had enough character and toughness and, and desire to go out and make a big difference after last night, and, and we did. I mean, it was one of the best matches that I've had a team play uh, since I've been here. It, it was that good of a match. Uh, and again, without Carly. Uh, so it's amazing just in 24 hours how much a team can change when uh, they have a little bit of time to, to reflect and, and search on, uh, on what they're doing. And um, so I, you know, I'm very, very happy with the way the seniors uh, changed their MO tonight and really took charge of the team and I uh, thought Ray had a good match but Errol Turner has never been any better you know she had the great tournament run last year but she was just as good if not better tonight and we're going to need that from her on a consistent basis.